Hi, I'm David Kress from Buyers Brokers Only LLC. Buyers often ask me about a seller concession for closing costs. Here's how it works. Let's say there's a purchase price of $200,000 and the buyer's estimated closing cost is about $6,000. The buyer has a choice. They can pay $200,000 for the property and pay their $6,000 of uh, closing costs at the closing. Or what they can do is they can have a seller concession for closing costs and ask the seller to pay those, those costs. The way that would it work is, is the buyer and the seller agree to increase the purchase price to $206,000 with the seller giving the buyer $6,000 seller concession for closing costs. So it's really a cash flow decision on the buyer's part, whether, it, whether or not they want to pay their closing costs at the closing for the lowest amount of mortgage as possible or increase the purchase price and roll their closing costs into the mortgage. To the seller, it's going to be the same net sale price of $200,000 one way or another. So it's really, again, a cash flow decision on the buyer's part. If you have any additional questions about a seller concession for closing costs or anything else related to real estate, please give me a call anytime.